Now let's take a look at the all-important email feature that will let you stay on top of your inbox while you're away from your desk. Setting up email on the Wildfire is quick and easy. First, go into your application menu and select Mail. For your work email, select Microsoft Exchange Active Sync. For another account, select one of the other options. Follow the prompts on the phone and enter your email address and password. In some cases, you will need a username and server settings. These can be obtained from your company's IT support person. Once you've successfully entered these details, you'll be ready to send and receive emails from virtually anywhere. Now let's have a look at setting up Bluetooth on the device. Bluetooth lets you share files with other Bluetooth capable devices, play music through compatible external entertainment systems, and of course lets you use your phone while driving using hands-free technology. First, open the application menu and select settings, then wireless and networks. Here you can also enable airplane mode and turn on and manage your Wi-Fi connections. Turn on your Bluetooth, then select Bluetooth settings and scan for devices. The phone is now looking for other Bluetooth devices in close range. Simply choose the device you wish to connect to. You may be asked for a PIN. This is generally either 0000 or 1234. Your device should now be paired with another device. Please remember Bluetooth is a feature that consumes battery power, so you should switch it off once you're finished using it. You're now on your way to discovering even more on your HTC Wildfire S. Have a look through the menus and explore the widgets and applications to make the most out of this amazing business tool. And remember, the more you practice, the easier it will become.